Hey, what's up everyone? So today, um, I'm going to be walking you through uh, an order. So anyway, let's get started. All right, so first thing first, I got my heat press. Um, we're going to be pressing this hoodie. I'm going to give it a quick pre-press. So I am using a DTF transfer for those of you that are wondering. Just give it a quick pre-press for, let's see, adjust the pressure real quick. Nope. I have my heat press at 317 for 18 seconds. That's what works because my heat's off. So 317 is like maybe like 305. So that's perfect for DTF. Anywhere in that range, 300 to 315. So about, yeah, 317 for mine is, yeah, so roughly 305 or so. All right, gave that a quick press. Um, we're gonna grab the transfer. So this is a cool little design I did for my friend. For my friend one of his designs let's figure this out i am gonna go about three fingers down or actually i'm gonna go about four just because it's a hoodie and i'm gonna try to center this as best as i can on here let's see I like to center it with the pocket down here. Put some tape down first. Okay, so there we go. I got it centered. So I'm gonna press this. Don't forget to put your paper, whatever you use, Teflon sheet, doesn't matter. Just make sure you got that covered. And then press it. I'm going to press it for 15 seconds. So let me change this real quick. Okay. 15 seconds. And then we're going to press it a second time for 10 seconds. Poly Miller and all that. Ready. And I'm going to go ahead and actually hot peel this. Even though it is a cold peel, I'm not, I like to to do a hot peel. It doesn't really change anything. All right, that looks good. Gonna give it another press for about ten seconds. All right, there it is. Perfect. Looks good see looks fine to me it's on there it's gonna be some good stretchability all right so now let me turn off my heat press i'm gonna show you how to fold a hoodie where the i fold it up to the where the pouch is and then i fold again and then i just lift the hood Here's the hood. I fold it back. I tuck it in. Just like this. And then I just, you could either go ahead and tie it. I tie it. Just give it a quick little. And then can flatten it out a little bit and then just fit it in your poly mailer or your whatever your clear packaging and then I'll throw in like a couple stickers or whatever if it's 
for the order and stuff. And then, yeah, that's basically, and then I just put it in a black poly mailer bag because that's what I use. And then just put this over. Bam. There you go. And that's how I do this. And then, yeah, just put it in a poly mailer bag, ship it out. And it's ready to go so that's what i'm going to do with this anyway i hope this uh video was informative some way some form but i just wanted to uh wanted to walk you through the process that i do so that is how i basically just you know pack my orders um yeah so so anyway if you guys have um any questions leave them down below in the comments Hit that like button it helps my channel grow and subscribe please i have so many viewers out there that aren't subscribed to my channel it'd be awesome if you could just help my channel grow and you know um, anyway thank you for watching all of you have a good one i'm out peace